Imagine this. You start your days packed with energy, without even needing that jolt of caffeine. You feel capable and active, your body and mind in synergy. Your body finally feels like home, not some adversary that you battle every day. You find yourself managing even chronic, stubborn disorders, like an out-of-sync thyroid, without an increasing load of medications and painkillers. You feel, act, and even look far happier than you've been in a long, long while. The vague but persistent malaise that you couldn't even explain to your doctors seems to be washing away, leaving you relieved and feeling hopeful. Now, what if I told you that this image is not mere theoretical fantasy, but scientifically achievable and possible? That just incorporating one simple lifestyle change can transform your life into its optimal potential. And that absolutely crucial element is the following, the Ayurvedic principle of healing your leaky gut. Now, what is a leaky gut? Simply put, it's an imbalanced digestive system. Pause to consider this. Your imbalanced digestive system may be the biggest reason behind even seemingly unrelated conditions like mood disorders, joint pain, or chronic headaches. It may be the one thing that's keeping you from achieving a fulfilling, healthy, and balanced life. The ancient, wise, holistic science of life from India, Ayurveda, tells us that healing your gut and balancing your digestive system is the biggest game changer you can introduce into your life and can create an absolute paradigm shift in your health. Right from common conditions like fatigue and anxiety to those that are more debilitating like diabetes, irritable bowel syndrome, or Crohn's disease, these can all be managed holistically by restoring your GI tract to its optimal structure and function. This is the very first step in addressing the root causes of disease and healing your body from the inside out. Because the truth is that your body wants to heal itself. One of the most powerful and fundamental principles of Ayurveda is its emphasis on self-healing. Your body has the capacity to repair and heal itself if provided the correct inputs and stimuli, no matter what its current state is, no matter how out of balance you think things are. By incorporating Ayurvedic healing into your lifestyle and diet, you can manage your most stubborn chronic conditions with decreasing dependence on heavy drugs like methotrexate or steroid injections for autoimmune disease. And what's more, you can prevent these conditions from taking root in your body even before they are diagnosed as you move through the different, challenging, and exciting stages of life. You can do this because my patients do, with my help, every day in my clinical practice. Hi, I'm Dr. Akhil Palanisamy, and I'm a Harvard-trained physician, an Ayurvedic practitioner, an author, and an integrative medicine specialist. And I specialize in treating the most complex conditions, including autoimmune diseases. And I am here to help you to get better. Over the course of this video, I'm going to share with you what I have learned at my clinical practice in San Francisco, where I combine Ayurveda and Western medicine to help my patients with an integrative, holistic approach. I studied Ayurveda in India at the Aryavaidya Chikitsalayam in Coimbatore, and then subsequently trained with my guru, Dr. L. Mahadevan, in Darisaram Kop Tamil Nadu at the Sri Sharada Ayurvedic Hospital. Dr. L. Mahadevan is an incredible teacher and source of knowledge, and I'm so grateful to him for sharing his Ayurvedic wisdom with me, which I in turn am sharing with you today. The best way I can explain the power of Ayurvedic healing is to take you on a journey with one of my own patients whose life has been changed by the power of Ayurveda. Erica was a 38-year-old successful entrepreneur from the Silicon Valley in California, and she came to see me for a condition she had just been diagnosed with, which is called ankylosing spondylitis. And that is an autoimmune inflammatory disease. It's a type of arthritis affecting the joints in the body, especially the large joints uh, along the spine and the back. She was suffering from very bad back pain and other joint pain, and she was taking ibuprofen daily. And in addition, she had chronic constipation, severe fatigue, and disabling anxiety that made it hard for her to function at work. She was, in other words, simply miserable. Despite following a paleo diet, which eliminates all grains and dairy and legumes, she did not see her suffering ease very much. After carefully examining her, I determined that she had an excess of vata, uh, which can be translated ed as wind, and a very weak agni, or digestive fire. Before we go further, don't get thrown off by all these terms. They are very easy to understand, and I will soon explain them to you. 
so I suggested some modifications to Erika's diet and lifestyle to help balance her elevated vata dosha. I advised her to incorporate certain spices with her meals, to eat hot foods, and to practice stress reduction techniques like meditation and also regular breathing techniques known as pranayama. And you'll be surprised to hear the clinically documented results. Within two months, she reported that her joint pain was 50% better, and in addition, her chronic constipation had improved. Her anxiety levels had plummeted. And that's not all. After three more months following the program, she was able to completely stop ibuprofen and remain stable and pain-free on the program of diet and supplements that I recommended for her. So you can see what a tremendous difference an Ayurvedic therapeutic program can make in someone's health. Before going any further, I want to talk about the particular stubborn chronic class of diseases in which Erica's disorder falls. And those are autoimmune disorders, which is the topic of our course. The simplest way to define an autoimmune disease is that it occurs when the body's immune system starts attacking a particular organ and causing it to malfunction. Examples of autoimmune diseases are type 1 diabetes, rheumatoid arthritis, Hashimoto's thyroid disease, and irritable bowel syndrome. So let's take type 1 diabetes as an example. So in this condition, the immune system is activated to destroy the cells in the pancreas that produce insulin, which helps with your blood sugar. And this leads to a deficiency of insulin and the body's inability to process carbohydrates effectively. Similarly, in the case of rheumatoid arthritis, the immune system starts attacking the small joints in the body, such as the wrist and the knuckles. And this leads to joint stiffness, joint pain, and decreased flexibility. Now, if you Google any of these conditions right now or visit conventional medical sites, you will see a disclaimer on each of these that autoimmune disorders have no cure and cannot be reversed. But I'm here to counter that myth. Whether you've been diagnosed with any of these increasingly common autoimmune conditions or are simply looking to feel better because vague but chronic and frustrating symptoms are bothering you, such as persistent aches, low energy levels, mood disorders, or hormone imbalance, an Ayurvedic approach towards healing your digestive system can and definitely will help you. So I am often asked, what is a medical doctor doing talking about combining Ayurveda and a paleo approach to nutrition? Well, I started out as a basic scientist with a passion for science, completing my undergraduate degree in biochemistry at Harvard University. And this was followed by medical school at the University of California, San Francisco, and subsequently residency training at Stanford University in family medicine. I then did a fellowship in integrative medicine with Dr. Andrew Weil at the University of Arizona. So over the course of this long medical, medical education, I developed a great interest in integrative medicine, which is combining various therapeutic approaches, both from the East and West, to heal the body from the inside out, and not just to suppress a disease, but to remove the root causes that created it in the first place. So I began thinking about why there was such an epidemic of chronic autoimmune diseases, metabolic conditions, and why medicine could only prescribe treatments that would suppress symptoms and not focus on healing. Was there a more integrative way to practice medicine that could help make lives better? With such a keen interest in holistic healing, I believe that studying Ayurveda was meant to happen in my life. So my unique approach combines paleo and Ayurvedic treatments to heal the body holistically. I have found that incorporating Ayurvedic healing at every level can make a huge difference to health and in fact rewire the very pathways along which disease proceeds. I have seen firsthand how my approach can make a difference in treating and reversing autoimmune disorders in particular. To help spread the power of Ayurvedic healing and in the hope to change lives, I have created a course with the Ayurveda Experience platform. This course comprehensively covers the knowledge and understanding required to help begin the journey of healing and transformation in both you and your family. Now, if you are a healthcare provider, or a physician, or holistic practitioner, this can help you better manage your patients with autoimmune disease. This course will also tell you how to identify and manage five specific common autoimmune conditions. These are Hashimoto's thyroid disease, rheumatoid arthritis, Crohn's disease, celiac disease, and psoriasis uh, and eczema. And these are all guided by my own medical approach and experience with patients working in my clinic every day. 
So remember that all the healing experiences I talk about in this course are derived from patients in my medical practice, and they're backed by my medical training and education about human physiology. The course is in high definition, it's easy to follow, and it's organized with carefully delineated modules, which will teach you how to embrace the power of Ayurveda to heal from within and not merely suppress symptoms. Rates of type 1 diabetes have increased by 500% since 1950, in countries that have kept careful statistics. And this is not just because of increased diagnosis, it's actually a true increase. Rates of celiac disease and autoimmune disease exacerbated by exposure to wheat and the proteins in wheat has also increased by about 500% in the past 50 years. And I'm sure you have seen around you the rate at which allergies, asthma, and eczema are rapidly increasing, especially in children. In some countries, food allergy now affects more than 10% of the population. So it really is an epidemic. And this is an epidemic that drugs can only control but not really get to the root cause of. Because these diseases can be healed and even reversed through a holistic combination of an Ayurvedic approach, dietary changes, nutritional supplements, practices, and specialized Ayurvedic techniques. Through this course, you will learn why autoimmune disease originates and settles in the body, and why diagnosing and treating a weak agni or digestive fire and the resulting leaky gut syndrome is the foundation of treating and reversing autoimmune disease. And you will also learn what it is about your unique physiology or prakriti that could make you susceptible to a particular autoimmune disease. So how is it that we can do that? catch a disease before it is even known or manifest. Well, Ayurveda tells us that pathogenesis, or the progression of disease, through the body moves in six stages. And stage five or six is when symptoms appear, and that's when conventional Western doctors will make the diagnosis of the disease. But fortunately, integrative medicine physicians like myself are trying more and more to catch disease earlier before it gets to this point. Because the earlier we can catch it, the easier it is to treat. Through this course, you will learn to identify very early signs of things just not being quite right, and you can begin to take corrective measures right there. And these could be at the earliest stages of disease. Um, stage one or two includes accumulation or sanchaya, or aggravation or prakopa. So at these early stages, disease is much easier to treat and reverse and to return the body to balance. And my course will tell you how healing the gut even if you have no digestive symptoms whatsoever, is always step one in reversing your condition and restoring your health. This course will teach you how to heal your gut by taking the following steps. First, by changing your diet and always eating for your prakriti or unique physiology. Then by eliminating food sensitivities, allergies, and other food intolerances from your diet. Next, by detoxification and clearing uh, the effects of stress and environmental factors from your body. And it will also talk about how to follow my unique Paleo-Vedic diet, which combines Paleo eating with Ayurvedic principles. And that's just the beginning. The course will also tell you how to adopt Ayurvedic practices at every level, in every day, to heal your body. By activating the body's extremely underrated but crucial parasympathetic nervous system, which controls rest and digestion, you can use mind-body healing techniques to help with self-healing. Using specific herbal supplements like Gugulu, Ashwagandha, Manjishta, and others, you'll learn how to work on the specific problems that you want to target. In addition, the course will help you understand your own body and its behavior in a lot more detail. You will learn important physiological concepts like the gut-skin axis, which is the close connection between gut health and skin health, and these will all be informed by my clinical expertise and medical understanding of the body. You'll also learn about concepts such as oxidative stress, and this is something which is responsible for the aging process and most chronic disease, and you'll learn how to counter that through Ayurveda. You'll learn about maintaining healthy blood sugar and metabolic wellness, and how to cure chronic inflammation, which is the root cause of most illness and specifically autoimmune disease. We'll talk about how to calm your stress through pranayama or breathing techniques and mind-body approaches like meditation. The course will explain to you why mind-body techniques are so crucial to health. Because the latest research from neuroscience has proven that we can literally change the structures of our brains through meditation and other practices through a concept known as neuroplasticity. And this course will tell you that each of these Ayurvedic practices is backed by hard science. And there's still more, because the course will discuss the detailed comprehensive treatment and management of five specific common autoimmune diseases. Hashimoto's thyroid disease, rheumatoid arthritis, 
Crohn's disease, celiac disease, and eczema and psoriasis. The course will teach you how to eat better, to reduce stress, achieve calmness, and live a productive and meaningful life. To feel, perform, and even look better in your day-to-day -day activities. So that anxiety, fatigue, breathlessness, and pain will become a thing of the past. So you can balance your emotions, balance your doshas, or the elements constituting your physiology, and even your chakras into a state of blissful well-being. Why wouldn't you want to change things when the first step may be as easy as changing what you eat for breakfast or the way that you're chewing your food? In fact, information about how to change is all around us, but we still hesitate because we don't know exactly how to embrace it. So start now and empower yourself by ordering this course. I promise that it'll be fun and easy to follow and, and filled with concepts that can not only change your life, but that of your entire family. And remember, these concepts are not theoretical, but based on science, they're practical, actionable, and strongly rooted in my experience with helping patients in my clinic every day. Remember that my patients have seen Ayurvedic therapy help them manage even stubborn conditions like a low thyroid or something known as ITP, which is immune thrombocytopenic purpura. And that's a serious autoimmune disease where the body attacks its own platelets, which are involved in blood clotting. And this can lead to excessive bruising and bleeding. But Ayurveda can even help in this case. And many patients have felt Ayurveda boost their immune function and reverse their autoimmune disease and help them to treat conditions with a minimal need for Western drugs. So my mission is to bring the power of integrative medicine and Ayurveda to the practice of Western medicine so we can treat and reverse the root causes of disease and not just prescribe drugs to treat symptoms. My Ayurveda experience course is a big part of that mission and now you can help too. So help to spread the word that there is hope through Ayurveda. The best part is you can do all of this for a fraction of the cost that you might have spent over the years seeking out medical practitioners, nutritionists, healthcare providers, and all sorts of cures. The course comes in three versions, silver, platinum, and gold. If you are not satisfied with the course for any reason, you can easily return it within 60 days through our money back guarantee. So I wanna thank you for taking the time to listening to this video and give you my very best wishes for your own health and healing and for continuing to bring the wisdom of Ayurveda into our world, which so desperately needs it right now. And I really hope that you will order this course now to begin on this journey of Ayurvedic healing together with me and to usher in a new and exciting energy-filled phase in your life of optimal health, vitality, and well-being. So come along to rediscover your own self and take control of your health. Namaste.